Hello everyone. Before I start, I want to ask you a question. Uh, what do you want to do after university? Uh, what? Okay, fine. Each year. Hmm? Go back to China to find a good job. Yeah, it's a great answer. He wants to go back to China and find a very good job because he can. Uh, although, if he, even though if he can't find a good job, he can work in his father's company. It's very easy to find a job for him. But in China now, uh, today I want to tell you the difficulties of finding jobs among graduated students in China. Do you know what they are doing? What they were doing? They were not waiting some some famous singer like Michael Jackson. They are finding a job. A lot of people, you know, all of them are graduated from university. They are graduate. They are university students, but they can't find a job. So let me show you some figure. Robots, uh, uh, American. What say, American reporter, and uh, he find that just 25% of college graduates kind, kind uh, just 25% uh, of college graduates cannot find a job in China in 19 in in 2010. It means what? It means in four university students, one cannot find a job. It's very terrible things. You hard work for maybe five, 15 years, and you can't find a job. I think it's terrible. And he also noticed that there are only two people can reach the requirements among 1,000 job competitors for his company. So I think it's very amazing. So today, I want to show you the reasons, effects, and my own recommendations of uh, of these things. First, I'd like to tell you some reasons of these things. Uh, we're going to say three opinions of three kind of people. First of all, I will, I will tell you the opinions of schoolers. And then I will tell you opinions from employers. And finally, I will tell you the opinions from graduated students, the students themselves. First of all, Let's say the opinions of the education worker, like the teacher, the school. They think the reason is about the government and the society conflict, because maybe more than more than eighty percent university doctor and university teacher think that the government should offer the work and the job for the university students, because they can do nothing. They just graduate from their university. But you know it's amazing. Our country didn't have a lot of work opportunity to give them. So the education workers think all of the reason is because our country is very poor. Our government our government can't offer the opportunity to graduates. And uh, they think in our, our our country there are a lot of people. The society conflict is very is is a lot. So they think a lot of people want the job, but only few people can get a job. So university students have a lot of pressure, so they can't find a job. And the employers, the boss, they think the reason is about education, families and the students themselves. First of all, the education. Everyone knows the Chinese education is not very good. It is one of the reasons why we study here but in Chinese, but in China. Because in our university, all of us very hard work in high school. We, we study until maybe 3 o'clock in the morning. But in university, what we do in university? Mm -hmm. We just play computer games, find girlfriends, and do, some, do something to waste our time. Because our university don't teach us anything useful, anything useful for our work. Who is him, do you know? He is a university student of a very famous university in China. When uh, he had that before took this picture, he just played a lot of computer games. He played maybe a lot of days. So he died. So it shows that 
our, our university students don't know what they should do. They just play. And their, their teacher, their, student, their school, don't teach them the useful things. So they don't know how to do, how to find the job. So they just play games. And their families, you know, the university students in China is not a lot. In China, maybe in 10 people, just five, just half of people are university students. So their family think the, they, they study in university and they are very proud of their children. So they don't want to do, they don't want, want they don't want their children to do anything, just want them to study. So they just no study, just no remember the article. So it's no use. So their family should responsible for should should respond this thing later. And the, finally, the students themselves, they think the society is unfairness. And uh, they think they should face a lot of reality pressure. First of all, you know, all of us can buy a car, buy some building very easily. But for them, it's very hard. They should fight their whole life, work every day to buy a car and a building. Mm -hmm. So they think the society is unfair. They think, I work very hard. But you didn't. But you didn't work. You can buy a car easily. I should fight for it. So they think it's unfair. So they have no power to work because because in their mind they think whatever they whatever whatever they do they can't they can't um, they can't get the they can't get the same money with us or with some rich men. And uh, they think they should face a lot of reality pressure. Because the pressure from their family, their family think they graduated from they graduate from the university, they have to find a very good job, but they can't, so it's a pressure. And the society, the public think they are university students, so they have to, they must find a better job than high school students, than some old people, but they can't, so it's their pressure. But in my opinion, all the reasons they have said. Or bullshit. It's no use. It's nothing. Why? Because all of them just care about their own benefits. They just care about The education, the education workers, they just want the, their students find the work to, to show their education is successful. But to be honest, Chinese education in a very big trouble now. They just teach something no use. Their students just know how to write how to write a word beautiful and how to remember article so it's no use for the work and for the both employers they just want to find the cheaper and uh, more useful more useful um, how to say they just want to find the they just want to use the more useful and uh, more and the cheaper people work to work in their company so they never give chance to the to the students who just uh, graduated from the university. And about the university students themselves, they just you know play the games and uh, show their anger to the public, show the society of fairness. They never, they never think that they have to, they must work hard to catch the other rich men, to be a rich man. They just, they just realize the, um, they just realize the unfairness. They never re realize uh, something behind the unfairness, because every rich man, uh, every rich man, were working hard, working very hard to be rich, though their children is rich. And uh, then, oh, maybe after after my introduction, some people won't care about this question a lot, this this problem a lot, although it is a very hot topic in China now. So now I want to tell you some effects and the results of this. First I want to say, first I want to tell you, it increased society pressure in China. You can see this man. He's also a university student. He's crying. He's cry he, he was crying. He, he may be, he may, I, I don't know, I don't know what he did, but he did something bad. So why he, why he do that? Because he cannot find a job. He have no money. So he should he he have to he have to live he have to still live 
So he wants to make the money, but he can't find a job. So he cries. It's, it's a very, very easy reason he cries. But, but we can't solve it. Because we can't, we can't offer a lot of jobs for him. Then our government can't give up them. Our government should pay a lot of money for them. China is a developing country. So we should use most of money to develop, develop our country. But now, our government should use a lot of money to feed them. I mean feed them. Because they have no use. But they are university students. So I think it's amazing. And then the effect of education. The effect of education is that no people want to go to university anymore. Because I cannot find a job after university. Why I go to university? Improve myself? It's too expensive to it's too expensive for normal family to improve their self to go to university because they should pay a lot of money. So the rich man choose study in study in university or other or study in America or other countries, such like us, because we can learn some skills for work uh, uh, in university. At least we can know we can find a we can find a normal job. Not very good job. We can just find a normal job after university in America. But they can do nothing. So the normal family won't let them teach her to go to university anymore. So our education will be destroyed. And then it will be a it will be a bad circulation circulation. Um, because they are very rich. Their children are rich. Their children have nothing to eat. Their children can't go to school, and uh, they, are, they, they make the bad effects to their children. And their children's children uh, also get the bad effects. So they are poor and more poor, and poor, poorer, poorer and poorer. So it's very, <laughs> it, so it's very terrible. Uh, according, according that, maybe every Chinese won't go to university. They won't they want to receive the education. They don't have any knowledge, and uh, they are very poor. And uh, they poor, and very country will be poor. So our country will be destroyed. Our government will be destroyed because every people don't want to don't want to get the education. Every people want to stay in poor. And uh, there are three of my recommendations of this. First of all, I think the boss and the employers should give them more chance, although they can do nothing. But I think. Give them chance, can, can you know, give them, give them opportunity. They can learn it when they work, because they are university students. Their their learning skills is much better than others. And then I think our our government should change of the education system, because you know, if we change the system, teach them something useful, they can find a job through their own skills. Uh, at, uh, at last, I think the students themselves, they need to face the reality. They should know what they need to do. They should know how they to be a rich man. I don't think they should continue thinking, thinking they are very angry because they are university students but they can't find a job. But I think we want to get the three, we want to get the three changes. Both of them need to need to change themselves, and they should care about others. I know it's hard, but we have to do it. If we don't do it, all our country will be destroyed. So, it's my conclusion. There are plenty of reasons of this issue. However, if it didn't not be fixed, it would be a big reason for society unrest. So do you have any questions? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs>